Hello everybody. Today's video is about the start process and the start of tank engines themselves. In this video, there are tanks from different countries. Enjoy watching. This video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. Your comments and criticisms are, of course, always welcomed. This first video shows the launch of the King Tiger. It is powered by a Maybach V12 gasoline engine with a working displacement of 23 liters and 700 horsepower. If anyone knows the exact principle of its startup and what they spin in the beginning, I'd be happy to read it in the comments below the video. starting of the Leopard 1, which was involved in military action in Yugoslavia. At the moment, it is a museum item, which is maintained by volunteers. It has a 34.7 liter multi-fuel 10-cylinder engine with 819 horsepower. Example of the starting Stug 3. It has it again, an engine from a Maybach. It is a gasoline V12 with a displacement of almost 12 liters and an output of 300 horsepower. Turbine engine starting up. You <laughs> can use a gas turbine engine. <laughs> Damn. You never guessed that, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's like a freaking like aircraft. of an M1A2 Abrams at New York Air Show. It has an AVCO Lycoming AGT 1500 gas turbine engine and a single unit with an automatic hydromechanical transmission. The engine capacity is approximately 1500 horsepower.
startup of a Leopard 2A7. It has an MTU multi fuel engine with a V12, 1400 horsepower, and 4700 Nm of torque. This video shows the launch of the Panther tank. It has the same engine as the King Tiger. It is a gasoline V12 made by Maybach with 690 horsepower. The next two scenes will be about Leopard. Different modifications than were in the video before, but their engines are the same. Hi, thanks for the question. I think about the fire videos, but then I need to come up with something special. Just at the fire, no one will watch. And about the chases, just happen to find and contact the author who has access to this material. Maybe other police departments either don't publish these videos or there are just less of them.